Presenting the complete range of GIC temperature controllers. All these controllers have various prominent features. This is how the product looks. PV stands for process value. TM is the indication for timer process on. SV stands for set value. AT is the indication for auto tuning process. Six LED indications, three for outputs and three for positive is equal to negative. Four keys for programming the device. A configurable exit key, a scroll down, a scroll up and an enter key. The temperature sensor used would be a PT100. The control method will be a PID for heating application to 100 degrees Celsius. Product part number is 151A12B. Single acting PID temperature controller with two relay and one SSR. Let us begin with the basic parameter setup. Start and power on the temperature controller from default factory settings after all necessary connections for temperature sensor and power supply are connected. First step is to select input. Press enter key for 3 seconds to enter into the main menu. Using scroll down key, go to I and P then press enter. SENS stands for sensor selection. The factory default setting is J type. To change this, press enter key and using scroll up key, change the sensor type to PT100 and press enter to store the setting. Press exit key twice to go to the home screen. For set point change from menu, press enter key for 3 seconds to enter into the main menu. SP stands for set point. To set the SP, press enter key and scroll to SP1 using up key. Press enter key again. SP1 will start blinking. Then you can change the SP1 value as per your requirement using scroll up or down keys. In this case, it is 100 degrees Celsius. Then press enter key to store the value. Press exit key to exit from SP menu. For output and alarm setting. Using scroll down key, go to OP, then press enter. OP1 is COP, that is controller output by factory default. Retain this setting for controlling purpose and proceed to OP2 and OP3. You can also use alarm functionality for outputs. For OP2, A1NO means output 2 will be on when alarm condition is true and A1NC means output 2 will be off when alarm condition is true. Press enter to store the selection. Press exit key twice to exit OP menu. For auto tuning, using scroll down key, go to RED setting. Press enter then select controlling type, PID or on off. In this case, we have to retain PID. After this selection, use the scroll down key for function menu to select heat or cool action. In this case, we have to retain heat action. Using scroll down key, proceed to auto which stands for auto tuning. Factory default is 2 which is auto tune at first power on. Retain this setting and exit to home screen by pressing exit twice. Now power reset the device to start auto tuning. For indication purpose, AT LED will blink until auto tuning process is completed. Once auto tuning is complete, product will start controlling the system. Shortcut key for set point change. Press configure key for 3 seconds. SP1 will start blinking. By using scroll up or down key, set the desired set point and press enter to store the value. Then press exit key to return to home screen. For factory reset, press enter key for 3 seconds to enter into the main menu. Then using scroll up key, go to R set, then press enter. Using scroll up key, 
change it to yes then press enter then select confirm yes by using scroll up key and press enter this will reset the device error messages for troubleshooting SENS stands for sensor break error that means sensor is interrupted kindly verify connection between sensor and device and check for sensor type OVRG stands for over range error that means the process value is above sensor limit. Kindly check sensor type. UNRG stands for under range error. That means the process value is below sensor limit. Kindly check sensor type. ERAT stands for auto tune error. That means auto tune cannot be stated because process value is too high or too low as compared to SP. Suitably adjust the SP. Fail stands for fail error. That means attempt was made to change the settings during auto-tune process. Kindly wait until auto-tune is complete. SSR stands for SSR error. That means SSR terminals are short. Kindly check SSR or overload condition. CBRK stands for loop break interrupt. That means the loop control is interrupted. Kindly make COP off. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, make sure to contact us or drop an inquiry on our website. GIC India, we stay committed to being excellent.